Hey everyone, it's Tiffany from Let's Get Scrappy and I know you are probably sick of me sharing these things with you. I can't help it. I I have a thousand projects going in my head. I have about a hundred projects actually going. I just, I, I, I can't help it. So I'm back with another project share using this die from Scrap Diva Designs. It is the coffee mug gift pouch and it could be so many things. Um, I, I can't wait for you guys to just see all, if you haven't already see all the examples that are out there, it's crazy how like one die can look totally different. Um, but I, I did, I, I, last night I played, I haven't been able to craft yet today. Um, but I did play last night and I just, I had to do some, some different ones. So if you saw before, I had some more girly, not, I mean, these are still girly, but more shabby chicy, let's say. Um, and then I wanted to try using up um, some other collections I had. So I just pulled out a six by six pad and just, you know, was watching a movie I shouldn't have been watching because it, well, it was like a series and I don't craft very fast when I'm watching TV and I don't craft fast anyway. So it's even worse. And I'm watching TV. But here is just another example of what um, it could look like. So, and I will pull, I don't have any of the stuff inside just so you guys can see in case you have this collection and you want to make the same thing. Um, and my links for everything is down below. Let's Get Scrappy is the code to use to get 10% off. And I just... I just think these are so fun. And I did grab these candy canes today. It's candy cane sticks, which I like. And it's really chunky. So it is really chunky in here. Um, so that is one thing. I, I'll show you guys in a sec. Hold on. And then, and I only made four of this style. Um, but I just used the collection. Um, I, I, I love this stamp set. It's leaves bundle or bundle of leaves, leaves bundle. I don't know. I will have it linked below if it's not in stock right now. Cause I think there was only a couple left last time I looked. Um, I think she said she was getting more of this and then the, um, Cap Capicelli. Uh, I don't remember the names, <laughs> but they're my favorite leaf dies. I love her branches and everything, and you can mix and match. I think one of them, like, yeah, these are two different style um, bundles. These two are, or you could do two of the exact same. These kind of look like little antlers to me, but, um, so I use some ephemera from the collection. Here is the flower that is in that collection. I did pop this little, like, I'm, I'm assuming this, well, okay. Hold on, let me back up. I was gonna say, this is the whipped cream part. No girl, you didn't know what the dye was because it was a snowman. <laughs> when Erica showed it on her thing, she's like, yes, and you have a snowman. I was like, oh, I get it now. That's why the flower <laughs> looks like that. <laughs> I about died. Who has got the dyes before? And has no clue what they are, but we had to have them all. But that's the beauty of it. You can use them however you want. If I want this to be whipped cream, the overflow of my mug, that's what it's going to be, darn it. <laughs> so, I had to go and make one really quick because I absolutely loved um, Erica's uh, vi um, video showing the snowman. I was like, that is stinking adorable. I need to make it. And... I had just got these um, snowman marshmallows. I thought was really cute. Of course, the spoon and I have lots of hot chocolate. <laughs> so those are in there, but just so you guys can see what this little baby looks like. Now, again, if you go and put like thick things in this pocket like this, this will not stick down all the way. Um, mine does pop up. This one's not bad. I put it down in one, it's on top of glitter. So I tried regular glue, I tried uh, hot glue, and it still was lifting up. And then um, I have red line tape under there. Right now it's holding pretty good with the red line tape. But because, you know, we're 
we're making the pouch go so far. Um, but I did pop all these up with foam tape. You don't have to do that. I did just give them little rosy cheeks. They're not even, but you know, <laughs> he has some, some uh, funky rosy cheeks there. And I tried doing like the white gel pen being all fancy. I'm not good with the gel pen, so Tiffany will not do that no more. Um, I just thought it was so cute. And she did glitter. She had a glitter hat all the way. Um, I have like this um, really like fine glitter. It's like a webby glitter to me. It's the one I usually use in my Halloween projects. And I had a scrap on my table and then I wanted like a foil um, brim. And or glossy, I should say, brim. And then I just used scraps that were all laying around. Um, just put some red behind here, black behind here, some of more of that glossy scraps, and then had um, punched these out with the flower. I just, I, I really just thought it was so cute. And on this one, I did go up because I told you guys that in the other video, you can go up, you don't have to seal it if you don't want to. Um, I still will probably seal this one, but I just wanted to play. And that's like the fun part about these dies is just plain. But I can't stress enough. One, these dies are amazing for craft fairs. If you guys have been watching, I've been talking about like the craft fair for a minute. I haven't shown all my videos. Those are all coming. Um, but they're just, I always use dies at Christmas time for gifts. Always. And mainly because I had a big team at work. I had 10 employees um, that were that directly reported to me that I always did big things. So um, I loved making. They love the handmade stuff more than the other things. So it's just fun to get, you know, you could put this still in a bag with the wine, with the whatever, and it's still really cute and fun. Um, but I'm, I'm going to put these in the craft fair. Um, so these ones, I have the silver spoon. And like I said, the um, candy stick. Now you still can do a candy cane. And let me see, where do I have, I have a candy cane box somewhere because I just got some. And I'm very picky about the, like it can't be, it can't look like it's, it's a dollar. <laughs> Like the, the dollar store has the little miniature candy canes and they're so ugly to me because it's like a U. It's not even a full little candy cane. Okay, I'm trying to get this out without breaking them because you know these break as soon as you pull them out. This one isn't like the cutest candy cane, but I just wanted to try. So if you don't want to do the stick, which I prefer the stick, I just think it's pretty. <clears throat> But you can do, and you could do coffee. I haven't picked up my coffee yet. Let's see, do I like it like that? And, uh, eh, I'm so picky. This is what takes me so long, because I am so picky. I'm not liking, like, the red, not matching the reds. See, I have issues. Don't like it. Hated it. Okay. Um, And then I just, I need a vote. So, Leave it like this and then put it in a, you know, a plastic bag or have the spoon and the candy cane to one side. So here's kind of a visual. What do you guys think? Well, I'm just going to pull these out just so you can see. I did not do like the gift card on the back. Um, I still might. I haven't decided. Um, but first and foremost, I just wanted to... Get a few of these made while it was in my head and then you have this one here and i did not glue this down yet because i was still deciding if i wanted that little sticker on there so i did um black cardstock here oh this one i did do did i do two of them i think i was starting oh yeah i did two two of them have the little spot for a gift card um but I did, um, what did I do? Oh, black artisan. <laughs> I have a little glue thing. Oh, get off of there. And then the, um, the glossy, like I showed in my tutorial on how to put these together. And then, um, just, you know, the, the pieces and I fit it so I can get 
as much out of like that six by six as possible. So I was able to get, let's say for example, all three of these pieces off of six by six. And some of it was using the little hole part up top, like here, there's a little hole right there from the top of the pad, but I knew I was covering it with this. So I was like, I'm using that because I might need that quarter inch somewhere. So I just kind of like flipped and mixed and matched. But again, just so you guys can see, what these look like and I think like the snowman would be adorable even as like just take the mug handle off like just as a tag that would be cute to hang from something um gift card could still go just in this pocket here I just I don't I just so many possibilities with dice you just gotta think beyond and obviously Tiffany does because she does never know exactly what the die was meant for in the first place what is wrong with me? Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, so there you guys go. Um, again, check out Scrap Diva Designs. Here are all the social media handles. Use my code, Let's Get Scrappy, to get 10% off, or you can um, click the referral link down below. But I will have this item linked. And again, just let me know. Are you guys getting sick of it? doesn't mean I'm going to stop. It just might mean, you know, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but I'm just, I'm having way too much fun. This is too much fun. I am not obviously mass producing like a hundred at a time because I'm taking my sweet time and I'm just playing. I'm just enjoying crafting. And if this is all I have at a craft fair is five like this and then, you know, three like the other, and then so be it no sweat just going with the flow having fun crafting and being creative so thank you guys so much for watching let me know what you guys think in the description box in the description box in the comments below um and definitely go check out uh, her dies and don't just look at like the the new dies look at all her dies because there's so many amazing things to mix and match but i i i still say get all her flower dies and her leaf dies they go with so many things all the time and they just make beautiful gifts. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please hit that notification bell and the subscribe button so that way you could see future projects. Thanks for watching. Bye.